So today we'll be showing you some videos of kids explaining movies. Oh, I'm so this. I love this. You will have to guess what movie they are talking about. Whoever can guess correctly gets a point. The person with the most points at the end of the challenge wins. Okay, good. I love this game. I do too. So the kids did have some limitations. They couldn't say any character names and they couldn't use any words from the movies that would give it away too much. So are you ready for this challenge? Let's get it in. Let's get have it fun. in. Have fun. I am going to win. You know what? And I was trying to be nice. It's going down. I'm going to win. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kids, you better nail this for me. Make man. it super clear for this little old lady brain. See, I got a, a sandbag, so I don't look bad if I do lose. I'm like, oh, I don't know. I think it's going to be a fair fight. Inside, I'm like, she's going down. This is going to be violent, <laughs> I can tell you. No, we're, this is, we're not taking we're each other down. 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 So here's the first kid explaining their movie. So the movie was about oh, um, a, so little blue, a little blue monster that had six arms, a but blue then monster. went to two arms. Six arms. That's familiar already. Six arms, but then went to two arms. What? I know. And then a little girl, and she it. was like really little. She used to get bullied, and she went to a dog store. Why do you know and this? And went to go get a pet, but they ended up finding the little blue monster there, and she's like, "I want that one, mom." Aww. And then they ended up getting. That one, that little blue monster, and now he only has two arms and helps her out every day. Wow. Sounds like a good movie. You start to think oh like you God. have it. I know. And like, then they keep so going. There's so many details like, in there. Oh, dang it. I and think I, I know it. Picture the main character, but I can't think of the name of the movie. And you're guessing three, two, one. Smurfs. Little Monsters. So know. this was Lilo and Stitch. Lilo and Stitch. Lilo and Stitch. I've definitely heard that. I was going to say Monsters Inc. Cookie Kids Monster. Play. This was Lilo and Stitch. Oh, oh Lilo and Stitch, so famous. I God, I come by and see that. Lilo and Stitch. Oh, God. No clue. So, yeah, Sharon, you got it. Lilo and Stitch. Lilo Monsters and Stitch. Z. Scott, you got it. Lilo okay. and Stitch. Yeah! Damn it! My confidence is just shattered. Hey, it's it's one nothing. There's still time. <laughs> Nicest guy in the world. <laughs> this one. There's this bad guy. Who is who basically like can transform into like basically anything. It like feeds off of fear. But then one day it came back to the town and then it had a little kid dragged into the sewer. <laughs> he went missing. I know it, but also tried to look for Really? He gets to watch that. That's amazing. Yeah. He went missing and then everyone tried to look for him. A couple of characters go off to try to find him, but then find the bad guy. Basically, they kind of defeat it by kicking it back into its, like, well. And then they all, like... It's doing a beautiful job. Say, like, okay, we'll meet back together if this thing ever shows up, so one of us will have to stay there. And then that's the end of it. Okay, that sounds... And this is a movie. So terrifying. Oh no. And I'm gonna be so mad if I'm wrong and it's this other movie that I can't oh remember the name God. of right now. You hey. should not have seen that movie. He is too little. <laughs> it's a remake where they, with that clown, that scary clown that's like in the sewer and they drag kids in there. Oh, you're no, talking no. about it? Yes, it. Jen, stop yes. helping him. Is that what it is? No, not it. What's it called? It? <laughs> no, wait. Make your guess in three, two, one. It. it. Yes, you both got a point. Clearly, I've been watching Stephen King and not Disney. It. it. Yes, this was it. I'm glad you. I'm glad you said that because I wasn't gonna know. I was gonna say Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> well, that's a sewer. That's <laughs> true. Sewer. It. it. Yes, this is it. Oh! Right. Wait, wait. Did I say it first? No, don't even, it. Like, don't even try. Uh, don't even try. She said it. Don't even try. It. It. Yes. Oh, yes. I only got that because there was like a parody and a laugh challenge of it like, oh. in the sewer. See, I just remember the very the original. So it's just like about no. that in the family member that instead of instead These of kids are cute. him having the job, she gets the job, and so she got a seriously really, really fantastic. And, and then so fast forward, these these they find that the baby has powers, and then oh okay, the baby has powers, and then. He tells got it. her, and then she got really excited, and then he started using his powers. There's so much. <laughs> There's so much. She was like, it's just too overwhelming. I can't wow. do this. It's, it's a lot. Okay, you can make your guess in three, two, one. Big Boss Baby! Harry know. Potter? So this was Incredibles 2. Oh. oh my god, because I knew 
See, I should have watched number two. I had and not seen, seen that it. first one. I haven't seen it. But then I thought both parents was working and they didn't have a mansion in number one. I have no idea. Incredibles 2. <laughs> yes, Scott. <laughs> that raccoon scene is one of the best scenes I think I've seen. This is my punishment ever. for not having. It's just a good movie. Like, I Incredibles know. is my favorite. Incredibles was a great movie. Yeah. I just didn't go see the second oh, one. Oh, it's good. The Incredibles, Incredibles 2. 2. Yes, okay. people thought okay. it. I coasted into that one. Like, I'm just going, all right, the only baby I know with superpowers. This is where it could all turn, though. This is, you know what I mean? Like, you get it on a roll, and this could be the part where you're just like, oh no. So I'm, I'm ready for my oh no moment. There was a boy, he went to go read. Then he was in what he was reading. There was a guy. He wanted to go save people. His horse died in mud. I got and it. There was a dragon creature. A dragon? And then there was a thing that attacked the dragon creature, and bad things happened. Then with something that happened in the story happened in real life. There's a thunderstorm. Then there's a, That's great. a princess. What? And mm -hmm. she says um, something or another. They can't, they can't so explain too. Cute. They can't explain too much. They're like trying to word it. But I can't explain it's so too much sweet. of it. <laughs> so cute, dude. If he really picked the movie I'm thinking of, ah, wow. I have no idea. I'm just gonna watch what Scott says, and I'm gonna say the same thing. <laughs> We're gonna do that thing. I really. have no idea. That was really good. What movies are you watching? <laughs> The best. I guess. <laughs> I'm going to throw a guess out there, but I am going way old school and I don't think it's true. Okay. Oh, I bet you got it. You guys can make your guess in three, two, one. Sleeping Beauty. Pop the Magic Dragon? So this was Never Ending Story. <laughs> wow. God, we're so bad. Are we getting a niff today? Shrek 3. Game of Thrones! <laughs> So this was Never Ending Story. Oh, oh Never Ending Story. I was wrong. Shoot. Never, oh, ending, never story. ending Story. That's right, yeah. Great um, movie. X-Men. Never Ending Story. It's Never Ending Story. That movie is, oh my gosh. I mean, he when knows I think about Never it. Ending Story. That's what's amazing to me. Like, that was part of my childhood. Never, never ending, ending Story. story. Yes. Yeah. What? Okay. All right. The horse died in the mud. So, yeah. The sad place yeah. or something like that. I think we were talking too much and giving her time to think. So if we could get to that <laughs> three, two, one a little quicker, it'd be great. So the movie is about this guy and he has to go into space and leave his daughter. And so when he's in space, he has to go to like the fifth dimension or whatever. And the reason why is because uh, on Earth, like all the crops are dying and stuff. And so to do that, he might like save the planet or whatever. And so, but when he's over there, time moves differently. And so like when his daughter is like 40, he'll still be 40. And so by the time he comes Sounds back, Sounds familiar, his but... daughter is actually about to die. And so oh, God. Uh, she, he actually gets to see her I... before she dies. And Gosh, he ends up saving the planet. And he ends up saving the planet and everything. And it made me cry and it was Aww. very sad. It made me cry and it was very sad. Wow, she explained that very well. <laughs> I feel did. like she if I good. knew the movie, she I would she good. explain that well. <laughs> Sid has a great it, explanation. Well, yeah. Of Sydney the movie I mean, that I have no idea what Even her mom has said she's like you know, her age going on 30. I'm probably gonna say the wrong name. I know who's in the movie. I know and who's I in the movie. I can't even like. I can't think of the name of it. Uh, it's so frustrating! I'm so irritated right now. No? Okay, so oh, I know I don't exactly think right. what it is. I can't think of the name. Oh, I'm worried. What if I say the, the star's name? Uh, no. <laughs> I like that. Half a point? No. <laughs> You can make your guess in three, two, one. Mars! This was Interstellar. What God. Is, what is that? Okay, well, uh, <laughs> gee, I need to watch more movies. Oh, Fifth no. Element! I have no idea. That was, was a good movie, though. Sydney was explaining Interstellar. 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 I don't think I saw oh, that. Oh, uh, Matthew McConaughey, Interstellar. It's, yeah. so many, it's so many space movies. So? I need to watch more movies. The Martians? You're so close, it's Interstellar. Oh! oh damn it, the Matthew McConaughey so movie. Oh. Sharon, you won. Woo! Nice, nice. A color nice, me Sharon. shocked. Yeah. Don't <laughs> Fine. Interstellar. Like Mary Jane What? Interstellar. You're right, it's Interstellar. <laughs> Oh, oh, good! God. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Yeah. Sydney did an amazing job. The, all the kids did an amazing job. Yeah. I feel like I have to go watch every movie that was ever 
made before and tried to think of it from a, like a eight year old's perspective. <laughs> See where I get to. Thanks for watching this episode on React Channel. Subscribe for new shows every single day. Hit that like button if you like this episode. What movie should the kids explain next? Let us know in the comments. Bye. Hey, I'm Katie, a React Channel producer. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Be sure to check out our Instagram at FBE to see what we're up to. Bye, guys.